Hey gang, Eric Vallon here, lifestyle portrait photographer based out of New York City. What we're going to deal with today is a common scenario as a location photographer. Lots of times we don't get the most ideal spot to make our portraits in. Right behind me I have a really cramped area which is common in the back of a church or an office or an event hall, wherever you might be shooting, but it does have beautiful window light and we do have this beautiful white wall that works as a great blank canvas. So I'm going to show you really quick and easily how with one small flash and the right modifier you can take a cramped confined space like this and walk away with a beautiful portrait. The only problem is, in a cramped location like this, I have to place my subject right in front of the window, which means the light isn't lighting her face, it's going to be backlighting her. So the difference in exposure is going to be pretty drastic. We have really bright light coming from behind, practically no light in the front, so this is where we're going to bring a flash off of the camera to build that up and balance out that exposure. All right, so for our first shot, we went ahead and took a photograph, no flash, and I realized that we had beautiful light from the window but her face was left in a lot of shadow because it was heavily backlit. So what I did is I set up a flash right here in front of her face with the soft modifier on it to light her up. Initially it looked a little too flat though so what I ended up doing is bringing the light around to the side, makes a little shorter light, a little more drama, a little more contrast. So now we have beautiful light on her face and we have beautiful light behind. The light modifier I use for this is the new Rogue Flashbender 2, it's the XL Pro, and I attach the front diffusion panel on it, which essentially makes it a softbox. Now the key to using this is the closer you bring a modifier to your subject, it appears larger and the softer the light gets. So by placing it on the side, I'm creating some shadow and contrast, but it's very soft light. So if you find yourself in a situation like this, where you have to make a quick and beautiful portrait in a confined place, best thing you can do is bring out one flash, a beautiful soft modifier like this, and then balance out your exposure with the light that you do have available. And the benefit of just having one light is it's really easy to move around. So you can do flat lighting like I did initially, or bring it over to the side for more contrast, or move it in really close to make it beautiful and soft. 